So the first thing you talked about was uh, the vertigo. Okay, it had been going on for like a year or so. And overall, what do you notice now with the vertigo? So I haven't had vertigo since, I guess, um, maybe a month from coming here. Okay. And I went away. Okay, so where was the vertigo at a month ago? Was it constantly there? Was it episodes? Const constantly, like every day. Okay. Like blurry, uh, headaches. Trouble like when you were driving at all? Yeah, uh, throwing up, Okay. fainting. And how long had the vertigo been going on for before you came to see us? Uh, probably about a year, I think. Okay. A year, a year and a half. Okay. And what were some of the different things you had tried for help with the vertigo before you came here? Uh, actually, I didn't get any help for the vertigo at all. Okay. Well, yeah, I did for the, uh, the pills that my sister gave me when they gave her. Um, <laughs> For her vertigo, she told me the name and I mm -hmm. went and bought them. Right. And that kind of helped a little bit, but I kept, had to kept, you know, keep taking them. Taking them. Okay. But if I stop, they'll come back. Okay. And, you know. and now, are you taking any of the pills at all? No. Okay. On that zero to ten, where is the vertigo at? Like a five or six, like pretty good, or like an eight or nine, like really, really good? Right now. Right now. Yeah. Overall. Zero. So no problems at all. Okay. No good. And then how about uh, the neck? You told us. Initially, the neck, the upper neck and the lower neck, just a sharp pain. Yeah. Did you been in the hospital before for it? Yeah. Okay. What's yeah. what's going on with that so far? Well, I went to the hospital this one time, and they told me it was stress. Okay. So they told me just go home and relax, mm -hmm. and they gave me Vicodin, I think, for the pain. Okay. And that's it. Okay. So I went home, and I still had the pain. Okay. Because I didn't drink the Vicodin, because it, it makes me more dizzy and mm -hmm. it's going to make it worse, I guess. Okay. And how has the neck been overall in the past month? Uh, no, no pain. No pain. Everything's doing no good there, too. The only thing that hurts is my shoulders from sleeping. Oh, just, sleeping on your sides. Okay. <laughs> my side. Okay. Now, how about uh, the lower back? You told me initially it was the lower back, just a dull ache that would go down into your left leg with the numbness and the tingling. Um, overall, what have you noticed with the lower back? Um, right now... I think it's like a five, maybe. Five, five or six, so five definitely a much better. Yeah, much better. But still ten. a long ways from being it was perfect. ten when I got a hundred when I got here. Yeah, yeah. it was horribly, it was horribly bad yeah. then. Okay. Couldn't work. Okay, and you said the headaches had gotten better also? Yeah, the headaches. Okay. No you had headaches. No headaches at all. Okay. And then how about, I'm just curious, you told us the, uh, the acid reflux. Just a mild amount of problems with your stomach. Any change with that yet, or is that still uh, the same? That, that's still the same. Okay, okay. Um, but I'm drinking some medicine for that. Okay, so and so that's keeping it controlled for you. Yeah. Okay. Now, I'm just curious with the adjustment itself, like your very first adjustment. We always tell people that it's going to be very, very light. Um, yeah. What? How would you describe the, the NUCA adjustment? Uh, did, I couldn't believe it. <laughs> did, I, what did you think? Like, well, that day I came in with a lot of pain. Mm -hmm. I remember I came with a lot of pain in my leg, my foot. And that, um, how long had that been going on, the pain in the foot for? Um, for maybe six months, I think. Okay. It was like six months when my legs started hurting. Uh, no, more. It's more, it's probably like two years, I remember now. Okay. But it will come and then go back and then come and then. Okay. But now it, now it was like every day, every mm -hmm. day. Uh, the first time I came in here, um, I, know, I couldn't believe it that you just did this. And I walked like fine, and I didn't have any pain. Like that, you walked out of the office actually. Yeah, I was like, my leg doesn't hurt. I was like, how can this be? I mean, like, I couldn't believe. It. And what did the, what is Vicente uh, think? Because he was sitting there, and he, he was like, I, he's like, does your leg hurt when we walked away? I'm like, no, it doesn't hurt. He's like, are you sure? I'm like, I'm positive. It doesn't work. It doesn't hurt. I mean, it doesn't doesn't hurt at all. And um. I don't know, I can't believe it. <laughs> and you tried other forms of chiropractic before, right? Yeah. You told me that it had helped. Yeah, I even had uh, the, what do you call it? The orthotics, the lifts? Yeah. yeah. And so the regular chiropractic had helped you in the past, but we still had the problems with the legs? Yeah, okay. I still had the problem with the leg. He fixed my back, she fixed mm -hmm. my back, but my leg is... No, she, okay. And so now you're to the point where you're almost thinking about going and getting a second job, yeah? Yeah. Because you're not worried about having to stand around for yeah, so long? 
Well, it starts hurting, I'll just come to you. Okay. <laughs> Picks well, me up again. <laughs> there we go. But overall, you know, we're doing great. The highs and lows, overall, we're staying pretty good. Yeah. Okay. Well, excellent. I can work fine. I'm not in pain. Um, I'm Your mood fine. overall? My mm. mood is better. Yeah. yeah I'm okay. fine. For well, my great. kids to play with them and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Well, good. Well, thank you so much. We'll get this thing finished up here, and then we'll be all set. And Jill, get your